اعوذ باللہ من الشیطان الرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم Let's assume you assess the impact of servant leadership on certain attitudes. Maybe, let's say, organizational commitment. And instead of finding positive relationship, you found a negative relationship. So either you are complementing the research or you are contradicting the research. And if you are contradicting the research, you have to explain why are you contradicting existing research. Now, I recently had a few questions on the channel as well plus on my email that we expected a positive relationship between two variables and we found a negative relationship. Now in this particular case obviously this is pretty normal you cannot change the data this is this that is totally unethical and not acceptable. Now in such case what you have to do is you have to explain the reasons why do you think that your results are negative when you expected them to be positive. Now this happened to me in my research as well. Let me show you that paper. Now in this particular study, we expected a positive relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction. Yeah. However, what we got was we got a negative relationship between the two variables. Look at this here. A negative relationship. So the direct effect of leadership on life satisfaction was negative. Now, instead of thinking of reasons as to how to cater this situation, we actually went on and discussed why do you think or why we thought servant leadership would negatively affect life satisfaction. When servant leadership is all about behaving ethically, development, emotional healing, empowerment, pioneering, relationship building and wisdom. Now, obviously, these characteristics of the leader must positively influence life satisfaction and this is what we expected. But our results were contrary to our expectation. So what we did was we tried to explain why. Contrary to the assertion and most surprisingly the study found a negative relationship between servant leadership and life satisfaction. Now you have to explain the reason for it and what was our reason. The results are contrary to the findings obviously when you are discussing your results. First thing is present your results. The second thing is how do they contradict or complement existing research. So the, our results were contradicting existing research by Chokhtai and Lee and others. Now the person oriented attitude of the servant leader makes way for safe and strong relationship within the organization. Perhaps a good leadership makes people enjoy work but this prevents employees to enjoy other dimensions of life. Now, if your leader is committed to you, you have to be committed to your leader as well. And now this can take a toll on your personal life. And additionally, it could be asserted that servant leaders make people more focused on their careers and less on their life. If the leader is encouraging to work hard, the employee may be happy with the career. I will get the professional rewards, but at the same time, he or she may be exhausted, physically exhausted and might become a workaholic and consequently it may impact negatively on their life and this is what we found now have a look at this now i do not have or i haven't presented a reference for all this argument but i have based my argument on the literature now discussion does not mean that you have whatever you write you have to base it base it on a certain literature that is already there well if you do not have any literature on something your arguments should be logical and they make and they should make sense so this is how you can explain if a certain relationship is negative when you expected it to be positive or it could be the other way around when you expected it to be negative and it comes out positive just the way let's say stress so you expected stress to be or having a negative relationship with let's say your level of commitment within the organization or your career satisfaction or your life satisfaction now it turns out to be positive now you have to explain why it was positive but logically thank you very much